It's talking crypto and stocks with Sly Fox. How y'all feeling out there today? I hope you're feeling grand. You understand? Here I am today. Again, right back at y'all, right? Ready to, uh, <clears throat> first off and foremost, I got to tackle this market, right? A lot happened over the weekend. You feel me? Everything dumped. People was talking about what's going on? What's going on? Everything was falling. Everything was falling. Uh, I stated before that when you in a recession, you really don't know you in a recession until about five or six months then pass, right? So my antennas is up. You feel me? So I'm like, is we in a recession? I got some bad news for y'all, but it's some good news at the same time that I got to tell y'all before I start covering this market, right? The bad news is the recession. I want y'all to listen up. The recession. It could start early. The feds is going to come out May 3rd, May 4th. Uh which is tomorrow and Wednesday, right? And discuss interest rate hikes. They're going to come out next month and discuss... Uh, no, that might be uh, the fourth consumer price index, right? So all this, the anticipation of all that is what's bringing the market down. You know what I mean? I don't think we in a recession yet, but I'm keeping my antennas up. You feel me? Now, the re if the Fed, the Feds, when they come out, they could bring, they could, the news could be so bad, they could start the recession based on that news, right? So, the bad news is if the recession starts early, is going to interfere with the bull run that's supposed to happen in the fourth quarter. I got to tell y'all this because it could happen. You know what I mean? And I can't just be here telling y'all good news like everybody else doing that y'all watching. You feel me? And they got millions of viewers. I got to tell y'all the bad stuff too, right? So it could possibly be an early recession, y'all by winter time you feel me and uh it, it's gonna ruin the bull run that was supposed to happen uh late fourth quarter right starting around uh september right so i had to get that out i'm glad i got it out i feel better you know what i mean so let's start with this uh with this market bitcoin 38.4 so Bitcoin is still in striking range. It could go back up past 40 real easy, or it could dip past the support level, which is what? What what did it dip to? 37.1? <clears throat> so 37 is the support level for Bitcoin, right? Ethereum, same thing, hanging around 3,000. So it could boost back up past three. Or it could go lower than 2800. It's 2844. Shiba Inu back up to 21. Over the weekend, it dipped down to 18. Now, the only reason why I didn't buy when it dipped down to 18 is because I'm not going to spend all my trading capital and then it keep dipping. And then I'm out of trading capital. I'm scrambling for capital. You know what I mean? So I'm going to hold up. I'm going to pause on the, on the buying of the cryptos and the stocks right now. You know what I mean? I'm going to pause on that for a minute. Just so I don't sell myself short. You feel me? Now, where they at right now, I pretty much did bulk uh, every coin on my watch list. But I wanted to keep DCA and N, which is dollar cost averaging in. For everybody that's new to the channel, that's that means put a little bit of money in at a time, right? So uh Shiba Inu is at 4021. It went down to 4018. 
the support level of Shiba Inu was 17, right? So if it dipped past 17, woo, Shiba girlfriend, uh, Shiba girlfriend, where we at? 30? Four Z eight zeros thirty. That went down to eight twenty five. Now I had the eight zeros twenty five. I had to. Did I grab some of the eight zeros twenty five? No, and it went back up. By the time I grabbed some, right? So, if it dip again, you know, I'm on it. You know what I mean? So, for those that don't know, when I first looked at Sheep GF, it was ten thousand dollars for a trillion coins. So when it dipped down to eight zeros twenty five, that means I could have bought it for twenty five hundred, a trillion. You feel me? So that's how much is down right now. Y'all pay attention. Crypto.com. I had to buy over the weekend. It dipped down right. It's it's twenty seven cent right now. For those that know, no. For those that don't know too, crypto was up. What was it up? Almost a dollar. Then it stayed around 50 cent, kept going down about 40, come back up to 50. It's 27 cent, people. If you're not buying crypto.com right now, I don't know what you're doing. ApeCoin has finally came back down. Remember I said I wasn't going to chase it at $19? This is why. It's $14.65 right now. It's down 12% on the day. You know what I mean? What's a good buy-in price? Sly Fox, if I was you, I would start dollar cost averaging in at about $11, $12. You know what I mean? Straight up. ApeCoin is, is like Goku. Like my man Goku said, ApeCoin is special. You feel me? So, uh, my economy is at a dollar three. Kid in the candy store. You feel me? The Central Land is at a dollar forty nine. Same thing. You know what I mean? Cavities all in the mouth. Sping. One cent 46. Everything is at the ideal level, but I got to pause on buying because when it dip again, I want to be able to get into that dip substantially. You know what I mean? I, I want to be able to get into that dip heavy. You feel me? So smooth love potion is at one cent two five people. You know what I mean? So we want to take advantage of that. Solana's at $87. Buying opportunities. Seller Network is at three cent three. Buying opportunities. Uh request is at 19 cent. Buying opportunity. Harvest Finance is at $82. Buying opportunity. Dodge Coin is at 13 cent. Buying opportunity. Jasmine is at one cent seven. All these is at a buying opportunity, people. Uh, Sheba Predator is at eighteen right now. What six zeros? Eighteen. So I'm a I'm gonna stop right there. I'm gonna go over a, a little content today. Uh, it's gonna be a short video. Roger Ver, he's the founder. A Bitcoin Cash, not Bitcoin. Bitcoin Cash, right? Roger Ver picks Dodge Coin to be the world's dominant crypto, and he's the owner of Bitcoin Cash. That's that that speaks volume, right? Let's move over to Shiba Inu. The community predicts a 42% rise in May. We in May. You feel me? Uh, I hope the community is right. You know what I mean? But if I'm right, the community shouldn't expect nothing more than a, a rise. You shouldn't expect nothing, to, you know what I mean, to decrease if you're part of the community, right? So going over to Sheba Girlfriend a little, little bit, right? So we're supposed to be getting listed on Bancor, right? Uh, for those that don't know, uh, Uniswap was encouraged by Bancor, right? So... I wanted to get that out. Uh, they had a meeting today. Uh, Bancor had a meeting today on Twitter. And it was basically discussing ways to keep Bancor hacker free. 
You know what I mean? They had a $600 million hack. So they basically figuring out how to stop the hack. You feel me? How hacks happen. I heard somebody say when it's wiggle room, you know, hackers thrive in that area right there. You know what I mean? So uh, they was talking about flash loans uh, provoking or, or being a way that hackers can hack, right? And if you don't know what a flash loan is, flash loans allows, a flash loan allows you to borrow large sums of money, you know what I mean, at a time. So you don't have to invest your own capital. You can invest that, you know what I mean, and, and come up, pay them back or whatnot. So, uh... Uh, that, that's basically it. They was, it was, it was basically a seminar about keeping the DeFi safe, and uh, it was, it, it was, it was not, it was, it was cool. You know what I mean? I don't got nothing bad to say about it. Uh, in other news, bears turn short-term tactically bullish, right? So that's what's going on. The NASDAQ, as the market was closing, the NASDAQ started heating up, right? It started going green. It was like two up 200 points, right? So uh, that's uh, that's why the market is uh, currently green, you know what I mean, uh, a little bit, you know, just kind of heated up towards the end. I got to go pick my daughter up right now from high school. I'm going to be late. I don't feel like getting the, the stare in the eye. You know what I mean? So I'm going to holler at y'all later. Love and peace always. 100. It's Talking Crypto and Stocks with Sly Fox.